love her. Okay. I'm Madison Honeyman. I'm a senior from Westside High School. <laughs> and this is my poem, Your Sobriety. I can't be mad at the fact that you're trying to be sober, but dad, can I just tell you how angry I am it took you this long? You caused me missed school days. You caused me emotional scars that'll never heal. You chose the bottle on the shelf instead of teaching me how to drive. You picked this instead of being there my entire high school career. But because now that you're deciding to get sober, I'm supposed to be happy for you. I'm supposed to put everything in my past and be there with my arms wide open. But this isn't the first time you've played sober. I can't force a smile as easy as you fix a drink. And I know I'm supposed to be happy for you. Well, a part of me is. Congratulations. But now that you've missed four years, there's a part of me you'll have to get to know all over again. You see, when you were giving up on yourself, I wanted nothing more but to give up too. But I knew I had two little girls looking up to me as I looked up to you. So instead of giving up, I told myself that if I just tried a little harder, maybe you'd change. But that wasn't the case. I feel like I saw you less and less, and I was told, your dad's getting better. But I only saw the addiction grow with Jack Daniels and UV Blue. I saw tequila swallow your words, and I saw fireball whiskey making your eyes black. Worst of all, I saw your reaction. I got hurt time and time again. You missed my first day of school. No, my last four first days of school, you missed my first dance. You missed my first heartbreak because you were too drunk to notice what you were doing to me. So instead. And so one day I woke up and told myself I would never be like you. How could someone choose this instead of raising his three little girls? And well, dad, I feel bad for you because there used to be a time I'd call myself daddy's little girl, a time where I wanted nothing more but to help you change your truck's tires. There was a time that, that we could sing and dance and now I can't even recall our song. There was a time that everyone used you, they asked you to buy them stuff and all I wanted was a simple car ride. Dad, I feel bad for you because you lost a relationship with one of your daughters. I used to be able to talk to you about every, anything. I'm the only one you would let see your tears. And now when something's wrong with you, you run away and chug vodka like there's no end. Dad, I feel bad for you because I'm 17 now. I'm going to graduate and I'm going to go off to college. I learned how to change my own tires because if there's one thing your addiction has taught me, it's to never give up. I know I'm not the reason you're getting sober. I know this won't be the last time. I know the alcohol is what makes you feel better, but I just hope I can be the reason you put the bottle down to watch me walk the stage in May. <laughs>